Police say two people in ski masks climbed on board a Metro bus and punched and shot a man while the bus was moving. Police say the masked gunman got on the bus at a Metro stop along Enclave Parkway near Briar Forest Drive. Melissa Correa is there in West Houston with more. That's right, the whole thing started along Enclave Parkway and it ended here on South Derry Ashford. Police say as soon as the bus stopped, passengers ran out in every direction. Investigators say cameras on board the bus will help paint a better picture of what happened inside just after 10 this morning. As for the pair in ski masks, Metro Police know they exited a black vehicle as soon as the bus pulled up to the stop. One person climbed on board from the back of the bus, the other from the front. They punched and shot the victim, a young man in his late teens, and then fled. Metro Police are not ready to call this an ambush, but when I asked them if people should be fearful of riding the bus now... Absolutely not. Based on what? How can you say that? Uh, based on the fact that this is not a usual occurrence, uh, which is why we have so much attention on it right now. Metro buses are safe. As a matter of fact, some of the safest in the country. The lieutenant did confirm Metro does not train bus drivers to respond to shootings, but says they do train for emergency situations. As of noon, police say the gunshot victim is still alive, though we are waiting for an update. Only one witness stuck around to talk to investigators. Police are now tracking down other passengers, as well as security camera video for neighboring homes and businesses. This area of West Houston has been busy with police activity today. About two hours after that bus shooting in a totally unrelated crime, police say another person was shot less than a mile and a half up the road. In West Houston, Melissa Correa, KHOU 11 News.